In this row, we're going to focus on volleys. Ira here really is a facilitator, and really the bulk of the uh, focus is on myself because I'm going to be trying to hit 10 in a row. It's good to just get some, again, like on the baseline, it's good to just get some general, you know, volleys, get warmed up. But quickly, you want to shift your focus to have a specific focus or intent. And that intent in this drill is for me to hit 10 volleys in a row. So this is not, this is not combined. This is my shots, my 10 volleys that land between the service line and the baseline. The key here is simplicity with your volley technique. You want to maintain a very steady, controlled racket face as you make contact. The players that will struggle with this, and many of you watching will struggle with this, I'm going to tell you right now, this sounds very simple. It's much, much, much more difficult than it seems. The key here is two things. Number one, making clean contact as often as possible, which sounds very basic. It is very basic, but I'm telling you, the majority of the volleys that you hit that land short will be from hitting off center, somewhere other than the middle. And then number two, to stay accurate and consistent, your racket face needs to stay steady. If there's a lot of moving around of your racket face, this obviously I'm exaggerating, but there's a lot of players with a lot of slop, a lot of extra movement of the racket head, and so they, can, they cannot execute, they cannot do this 10 times in a row. Uh, so let's give it a shot, Ira. Now, uh, Ira's gonna be hitting me realistic shots. He's not trying to beat me, this is cooperative but he's not going to be just, you know, serving it up on a silver platter on a silver platter either. He's going to be hitting, you know, a solid shot for our level of play. That's one. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Ah, oh, ah, all right, I'll get it this time. Tough shot by Ira, but I should make that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine. Okay. Now a lot of people will execute this drill and they'll say, well, those weren't really good shots. Those weren't competitive shots. Start from here. If you do not have a foundation of being able to just place the ball on the other side of the court with your volleys, then trying to layer offensiveness or aggressiveness on top of that will be a disaster. You'll just make many, many more unforced errors than you really should. So this is my favorite drill to get volleys warmed up. Really challenge yourself to be accurate and consistent and really focus on a particular target. In this particular case, it is a depth target.